is up what's going on welcome to my beautiful abundant youtube channel thank you so much for tuning in today i appreciate every single last one of you um so for today's video i wanted to talk about the importance of living an intentional life you know it is the new year we are two months into this year and i really want to set everybody up for success i have really been um, making sure that I am intentional in my life and I am really starting to see a difference. My energy is better. My life is better and I just feel really good. So I wanted to share a couple of things with you guys to live an intentional life. So why would you want to live an intentional life? If you have a goal that you are trying to get to, y'all, it is so crucial, okay? It is so crucial to understand why First of all, why do you even want this goal? Why did you create this goal? And then not only that is to be intentional of, okay, well, what am I going to do to achieve this goal? It's it's not enough just to write it down. You know, I personally don't like to write goals. I like to write intentions just because I feel as if if I have the intent to do something, I'm going to do it. If my intention behind something is good, if it's valid, if it's understand, if it's understood, <laughs> then I'm able to do it better versus just setting a goal and not really having the right intentions behind it. So, um, so first and foremost, look at your goals. What goals do you have for yourself? And when you wake up every day, figure out what you need to be intentional about in order to get that done. So let's say, for instance, you have the, ten the intent to um, find a job today. Okay, you want to find a job. That is what your intent is. I'm not going to say today, but let's just say, for instance, your intent is to find a job within the next month or two months. So what do you need to do in order to get that job? You need to wake up every day with the intent to find a job. So with that being said, you need to wake up every day. You need to look for jobs. You Well, first of all, before you even look for a job, you need to go within yourself and be intentional and figure out what makes you happy. You know, what do you want to do? And once you figure that out, look for jobs you know don't just sit on a couch eating popcorn watching tv you know not doing what you need to do look for jobs go out and network go to different jobs and say hey are you hiring call different places ask around you know go to social media go to linkedin you know be intentional with your life if you are studying to be a doctor what are you doing in order to live an intentional life to get to your goal you know a lot of times you know we set these goals and we want to do things but the intention behind it is impure so we're unable to actually go through with that goal you know especially for me like when i set goals to work out the intent behind it is yeah i want to lose weight but Every day, I don't wake up intentional enough to lose weight. I don't. You know, I don't wake up every day and be like, okay, I'm going to make sure that I eat healthy today because my goal is to lose weight. So I have to hold myself accountable and I'm going to cut this out of my diet. You know, I'm going to be accountable and make sure that I'm working out for this amount of time. I'm going to be accountable and make sure that I'm not being lazy, sitting on a couch all day, eating things, letting the weight gain. You know, I'm going to be accountable about my life and I'm going to go for what I want. And so I want to give you guys a couple of questions that I like to ask myself um, to keep to make sure that I am on track. So let's say, for instance, you know, I am wanting to clean my room. But let's say, for instance, I'm slacking off and I'm not doing what I need to be doing and I'm sitting down and I'm chilling. So one thing that I like to do is so I ask myself, what am I doing right now? Oh, you know, I'm just sitting down watching TV. Why am I doing this? Uh, because I'm lazy. Okay, what is this doing for me? Where is this getting me? It's not getting me anywhere because my room is not getting done. So as a result of me being lazy, as a result of me laying down watching TV, as a result of me not doing what it is that I need to do, my room is not being cleaned. So my goal is not being accomplished because I am not living intentionally doing the things that I need to do to get to where I need to go. So I'm just saying that to say when you are doing something, ask yourself, what am I doing right now? How is this helping me? How is this getting me closer to my goals? And if it's not, then figure out what it is that you need to do to redirect yourself, to get yourself back onto that track. Um, another question, I wrote down a couple just to make sure, is how did this happen? How did I get to this point? Figure out that. How did I get to this point? Is it because, you know, you weren't intentional? Is it because that you weren't aware? Is it because you weren't paying attention? What is it? Why? How did you get to this point? Okay, once you figure that out, what was my part in me getting to this point? How, why am I here right now? What is my part in it? Because not everything is everybody else's fault. So that's where accountability comes in. What is my part in it? 
And then once you figure out what your part is, figure out what you can do to change and change that and keep that in your in the back of your mind for every day. Even if you have to come up with a plan every day, if you have to map out your day to, to stay on track and to do what you need to do, do that. You know, um, one thing that I like to do is I take post notes and I will write certain things on it and I will post up little post notes throughout my house, uh, whether that be something I need to do as far as a task or if there's just motivation to keep me going. I am intentional throughout my life because I know who I am. I know that I forget stuff a lot of times. <laughs> I know that um, I fall short sometimes when it comes to my goals. So I am now being more intentional to make sure that I remember things and that I'm staying on track. So I put up posting notes around my, stuff, my house to keep myself on track. So live your intentional life. Figure out what it is that you need to do to actually accomplish your goals and stop just setting goals and don't have the intent behind it. Finding out what the intent behind your goal is is what's gonna help you get to that level. You know, you can't just set a goal and just be like, oh, I'm gonna lose weight, and then just expect to do it. You know, some people are able to do that, but some people know you have to figure out what drives you. What is the intention behind the goals that you're setting? And then, after you figure that out, what is the intent of your day? Wake up with the intent to do something today. Don't just wake up just and just wake up and be like, okay, all right, well, I'm just gonna do whatever. No, if you have goals, be intentional. You know, wake up and study. You know, make yourself study. Be intentional to go outside and get some fresh air. Live your life with intent. Have a plan, write things out to get to where you need to be at in life. So if you, okay, have not started your goals, if you have not um, done anything that you wanted to do for the new year as of yet, this is the most loving, okay, most loving reminder to get on your shit and be intentional, okay? We are in this together. Like, I am growing, I am elevating, you are growing, and you are elevating. And through this journey, we are here to encourage each other and to help each other grow and strive and be the best people that we can be. So be intentional. Figure out what you want and get the intention behind it. If you have to write your intentions out, definitely do that. Write your intentions out. Put them around the house. What is your intention for today? Do what you want to do and get it done, okay? No more being lazy. No more, you know, just bullshitting throughout the day. No. Figure out what you want to get done and get it done, okay? All right, so thank you so much for tuning into this video. I appreciate it so much. If you don't mind, okay, comment down below and let me know if you like this video. Let me know if you like my new setup. Um, like this video, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you can stay updated when I post future videos and I will see you in the next one. Bye, peace out.